Greetings, Toy Heads, and welcome to another episode of Go Figure with me, your host, Eli Williams. And today we're having a look at my Mega Hasbro toy haul from uh, my local Ollie's. And um, I went there last night, and they had some uh, new stuff. Looks like they're gearing up for the holiday season. I went there with anticipation and hope that I would pick up the Thor and uh, Destroyer 2-pack, but they did not have those. Um, so I'm going to try to get my hands on those because th that one's been marked down really cheap, and uh, it's a pretty good deal. But I did uh, get these things, and they had a bunch of uh, new stuff that they put out, and a few old things that I picked up as well. First off, I've got Kang the Conqueror from the Ant-Man and Wasp Quantum Mania. Um, I don't have the uh, comic book Kang, and uh, I now I've got uh, now I've got the MCU Kang, and this is uh, the Cassie Lang build a figure. I may end up getting um, I may end up getting this because I don't know. I may I may get this. I might try to source out the pieces. Or maybe get the figures, but I'm only I don't need when I need the Ultron. Uh, I have Egghead, which also has a piece. Um, Crossfire, yeah, I don't know, but this one comes with the unmasked and masked head of Cassie Lang. So I got that. That was ten bucks, and uh, then I'll just sit that right there. Then they also had Marvel's Egghead, as I said here, and it is also part of that wave. Um, I didn't have this figure, and I'm a sucker for the suit bodies because I love doing custom kit bashing with these suit bodies. Um, and I thought this one would be a cool one, and it is also part of that. It was $10, too. It was also part of that Cassie Lang Build-A-Figure. Um, so I thought, yeah, that one's pretty cool. And then <clears throat> we have the uh, Captain America Bucky Barnes uh, from the Avengers uh, 60 Years Wave. And uh, I didn't have that. I've got plenty of Captain Americas, but I saw it, and it was 10 bucks. so I thought, well, what the hell, I'll get this too. Um, not part of a Build-A-Figure wave, but uh, still pretty cool. Um, yeah, not too shabby. And then uh, I saw this, and it was 20 bucks, and it is the Black Knight and Circe 2-pack, um, also from the 60 Years uh, lineup. And uh, I thought that's, I mean, it's a great deal because it's, this was like 50 or 60 bucks, I believe. And uh, I saw it and I grabbed it because I, I don't have the Black Knight and I don't have Circe, but uh, I thought that's pretty cool. I will get that. Um, and then um, I s came across this. The uh, I, I have the original Deluxe Dritz Dorden uh, that came with Guinevar, but uh, this one I saw and I thought that's pretty cool. And it was, it was 10 bucks. And uh, so I'm going to get that and put it up on my D&D &D shelf with all my other D&D &D characters. The RA, got the RA Salvatore uh, autograph uh, name written on the front of the box there. But uh, yeah, I thought this was, a, this was a, pretty cool, a pretty cool figure. And I'll just put him up there next to my other Dritzed. <clears throat> and then uh, this one they'd finally marked down from 19.99 to 12.90 or I think it was no I think it was 15.99 or 14.99 but they knocked a couple bucks off and since I recently got the Guardians of the Galaxy I thought you know what it would be good to have this and add it to my Marvel uh, villains shelf of my DCU uh, DCU <laughs> I got that on the brain right now MCU uh, shelf. And uh, I thought that would be a good addition to that. So I thought, what the heck, Ronan the Accuser uh, from the first 10 years. Uh, they've been sitting on these for a while. They still got a pile of them there. Uh, and then <clears throat> I happened to look down one of the aisles on one of the kiosks, and I found this. And I was like, whoa, and I grabbed it, and there was a guy behind me who was like, oh, man, because it was the last one they had. Uh, it, it was 25 bucks, but I thought, I got to get this because I don't have Storm, I don't have Forge, and I don't have Jubilee. And I have some of the other 97 figures uh, in the blue and yellow. And I thought, well, uh, I might as well have these up there too. And uh, I grabbed it. And this was, I didn't see any more of this. And this is from the 60 Years uh, lineup too. Um I was really super excited about this because I don't have any, I don't have a storm or a Jubilee and I don't have any forge. So that 
was a really good find. So yeah, that pretty much uh, that pretty much wraps up my Ollie's toy haul. Just thought I'd share that with you since I, I I pick up stuff there from time to time, but I don't ever get a whole bunch of stuff. So I thought well, I'll line all these up and share them with you. And there will be unboxing and reviews of all of these coming eventually. I've got a huge pile of figures to go through and do unboxing and reviews. Um, today I'm I'm doing the McFarlane Dark Side and the uh, Werewolf by Midnight Marvel Legends Man Thing, and I um, I, I got a couple others I need to work on too. So. But I wanted to share this with you, so that will do it. Uh, I hope you enjoyed that. Please remember to like, comment, and subscribe. Curse, smash that bell so you can get information on all the good things coming out of my channel. You all have yourselves a great week and a great day. I'll see you next time, and until then, don't forget to get your figure on. Take care.